morning ma'am very good morning can i know your name please yes ma'am my name is shravani okay can i have your resume yes ma'am okay okay shravani please introduce yourself good morning ma'am good morning ma'am thank you for giving me this opportunity to introduce myself my name is shravani i am from karimnagar but currently staying in hyderabad i completed my bsc graduation from st francis college for women begumpet which is affiliated to usmania university in the year to the in the year 2021 i have technical skills like manual testing for java and sql my hobbies are listening to music and uh, cooking etc i have i have skills like um, self adaptable and self motivated hard working that's all about me ma'am thank you okay as your technical skills my technical skills are code java sql and manual testing okay fine i will ask you few questions in sql i uh, you need to write the queries also are you willing to write the queries yes ma'am okay first of all tell me what is sql sql is a structured structured query language uh, which interacts with rdbms to store update delete and retrieve the data okay What is MySQL? MySQL is an open source relation. MySQL is an open source relational database management system. Okay. Uh, tell me uh, what is the main difference uh, between SQL and MySQL? In SQL, it interacts with RDBMS to store, update, delete, and retrieve the data. In MySQL, it is an open source relation management system. Okay. Nice. Is SQL supports programming language? Yes, ma'am. Why it connects with RDBMS database? Okay. Good. Tell me few SQL statements. Yes, some of the SQL statements are DDL, DCL, and DML. Yeah. What is the purpose of DML statement? DML statements are used for searching, de- updating, deleting, uh, and inserting data. Okay. Please take down this pen and paper. Type the SQL statement for update the data. to update the data we use update keyword table name set uh, to update whichever name we want to update we have to write the name and where the id we have to update we have to write the value also okay fine what is like operator like operator it filters all the records from the column column table and also uh, which is based on pattern specified okay right um Write the SQL statement for like operator. No. Okay. Select the star from table name. Where name? A module. Okay. A module. What is the like operator? What is the purpose? Uh, by using like operator, we can get the uh, uh, values in alphabetical order. Okay. Here we are taking A, so we get the values on A. Hmm. Which other values? Sir? In this place, we will take yes. Uh, we will get the values from S. Yes, it will get the values from S. Okay, good. And uh, okay, tell me few differences between having and where class. having class is placed after the group by name where where class is placed before the group by name having class filters all the data from the groups uh, where class only filters the particular data um, having class uses the aggregate functions where where class does not use any aggregate functions okay what is distinct keyword distinct keyword it deletes all the duplicate data and fetches the unique data write the sql statement for distinct keyword okay 
select distinct star from table name. What is the purpose over here? Here to distinct, uh, if we want to delete the data, duplicate data, we are using the distinct keyword so that our duplicate data will be deleted and it provides us the unique data. Okay, nice. Tell me a few SQL constraints. SQL constraints are of six. Uh, not null, default, unique, primary key, foreign key and check. What is primary key? Primary key is used to identify the unique row in the table. What about foreign key? Foreign key value in foreign key column and values of one table refers with the primary key of another under the table. Okay. Write down the SQL statement for both primary key as well as foreign key. Okay. To create a primary key, we are using the keyword create and we are using the primary key here so that it only identifies the unique, the unique data. Create the table table name in the place yes I will be in the primary key after that name varcat okay create the table table name s i d int name varcat from the foreign key okay what is the purpose of fire uh, foreign key here what is the purpose of uh, primary key here so primary key it uh, it delete it uh, it identifies the duplicate it identifies the unique data but in foreign key, it takes the references of primary key. Here primary key acts as a parent table and foreign key acts as a child table. Okay. Primary is a parent and foreign, foreign key is a child. child. Okay. Reference value should be there in foreign key. Okay. We are keeping the reference from foreign key. Primary key. Primary key. Yes. Okay. Write the SQL statement for second highest salary. How we will get the second highest salary from there? Select maximum in the price salary from employees where salary greater than less okay sorry less than select maximum salary in the price from employees. What is the purpose of greater uh, less than here? Now if we take equals to we will get the highest salary from the table from the column table, but if we are uh, using less than mm -hmm. it will get the next second highest salary. Okay. okay good. Tell me if you joins in a scale. Joins are of four types. Inner join, left outer join, right outer join and full join. Okay. Write down the SQL segment for full join. Select the star from table name, full join and 
table name two. Okay, what is the purpose of full join here? Here we are using full join because it gets all the all the data like matching matching data and non matching data from the table. Okay. Uh, as well as write the syntax for inner join also. Select the star from table name, inner join, table name to on table dot column value equal to table name to dot column value. What is the purpose of inner join? What is the, doing in the, uh, what is the inner join we are doing? What is the role? If we use inner join, we will get all the common, the common data from the both the tables. Okay. By using inner join, we will get the we'll common, common data. data. Yes. Both tables. From both tables. Okay, fine. Write an SQL statement to create a table with few columns. Create table, table name, column value and column value. Here we are taking only two columns or any, uh, many. We can take many, uh, some more columns also. More columns. Okay. We are using create keyword to create the table. Hmm. Yeah, okay, fine. This is the query. We have a employee table. Okay, in this table. Write the SQL statement to select data from the table using WHERE class. Write the uh, query using WHERE class. Okay, ma'am. Select name from employee where ID is 20. Okay. We are getting ID is 20. Uh, what is the output? Global. We are getting the? Here we are taking ID as yes. 20. Hmm. So we will get the name as global. Global is the output. Yes. Okay. Write an SQL statement for having class. Select count star from employee group by having equal to having name. Okay. Right. What is the group by over here? Group by will get the data in groups. Okay. Identical data in groups. So by using having clause, mm -hmm. the having clause places some conditions on group by. Okay. Yes, go. What is the default constraint? Default constraint, if you don't provide any values, then the default constraint will provide the default values. Write on the statement.
create table table name in the brace SID int name var 20 default Sony. Okay. It will provide the default values. Yes. Okay. If you don't give any default value, then uh, default constraint will provide us the default value. Hmm. Good. Write an SQL statement to delete the table. How we will delete the table? To delete the table, we will use the keyword drop. Hmm. So okay. Table table name. Okay. It will close just a table or entire uh, only table. It will release the table. Okay. It will release the only yes sir. table. Okay. Write an SQL statement for to select a few columns data from this table by using this table. Select a few columns data from the table. from employees it will getting all the employees name as well as id's also column column so okay column okay. Column. Okay. okay nice yeah okay shani your communication is good but uh, you need to improve your body language like eye contact next time you will be better okay okay ma'am thank you thank you